Hi guys, it's your girl Kill Chemist and I'm popping on camera. As I mentioned, I have some haul videos to do. Um, I can pretty much tell you now they are all, pretty sure all accessory hauls. Um, not that I ever need another accessory in my lifetime, but um, I love the uniqueness of accessories and the fact that you can attain a lot of them for very inexpensive prices. So um, the jewelry I'm about to share with you today are some pieces that I picked up on eBay. I think collectively I spent maybe 14 bucks. Um, I learned about this seller from watching a video by Bronze Goddess. She did an outfit of the day for a white party outfit and she wore this really bold statement necklace. I love the necklace. Um, I did not buy necklaces um, from this vendor because I have some pieces that I've had for many years that I don't really wear and I feel like until I start incorporating necklaces into my um, wardrobe it wasn't really a good idea to purchase a whole lot of additional necklaces. Um, I tend to be more of a large earring wearer than a large necklace wear and I don't think you should really mix the two. So, um, but I did go on again, like I said, and look around and I found that I saw a lot of cute pieces that were really inexpensive. So I'm gonna share with you what I ended up purchasing. The seller is New Service 1988. They are in China. I will say after I um, paid via PayPal and my payment posted, they immediately contacted me sent the email, you know, noting that they had received my order and also sent an order with tracking information when my package was mailed. And I did receive it probably within like a week and a half after the mailing of the package. So they are very, at least my experience was very good with them. So if you have a concern about ordering things from another country, particularly China, maybe that'll help put your mind at ease a little bit, at least for this seller, because I had no issues at all. So without further ado, let me show you the pieces that I got. So the first piece I got is called a Retro Red Coralite Crystal Ring. It was $2. And here it is. It has this like coral stone in the center with marbling. I'm pretty sure this is probably not genuine anything, but it's just really cute. It's like an aged gold textured kind of gold metal. And then on the side, if you can see that, there are those red crystals and then just a little pop of a turquoise crystal, which really just gives it a really interesting look with the kind of coral surrounded by the red and turquoise. This is really beautiful. And as you can see, it's, you know, it's a nice size ring, and I paid $2 for it. And it's, it's well put together. I don't feel like, you know, things are going to start popping off of it. Well put together. So that's the first piece. The second piece that I got is oh, this beautiful dome ring. It is a, um, a the, now the first ring was not adjustable. I had to get it in my size. This next ring is adjustable. Um, it was $1.99. It's a multicolor rhinestone dome ring. I've really gotten into rings ever since I started kind of letting my nails grow out and keeping my hands nice and manicured. I just like the look of a ring on my hand. So this is the dome ring. I don't know how well you can see it, but you can see it has multiple large rhinestones and then in the background of those large rhinestones are some smaller rhinestones. Can you see? see and see how it picks up the light and just sparkles? It, this is what it looks like on. So it sits up nicely off the hand and it really catches the light in the eye and you can wear this with so many different things, so many different earrings, so many different outfits. So very cute. And again, that was $1.99. The next ring I got um, was, this is a size 8. It's a uh, retro vintage red crystal dome ring. Another dome ring. It has a red stone in the center. And it's surrounded by like what I would say is like kind of a marcasite-like um, setting. So that is the ring. Really pretty red center. Uh, love this little like silver setting detail with the like little um, etch design there. Kind of has like a rope looking detail and then the marcasite is on the side. And it's silver and I just think it's a really pretty ring. I mean if I was walking by or threw my hand up, you, you're going to like your eyes go to this to this ring so very pretty and this ring was $2.99 it has a little more weight to it um, but it was $2.99 three bucks 
Then I also got these really cute, oh gosh, they're so dainty, and I know you're going to be like, really, where are you going to ever wear those little itty bitty studs? But they are so cute. Um, they're a gold tone. They also had them in silver. They were a dollar and fifty four cents. So I don't know if you can read that, but it says love. And the pearl is the O. It's kind of hard. Right? My camera doesn't really focus. But it says love. And I'm actually going to wear, I have like some holes in this ear, like up top. I want to put like one up there, I think. Um, and I don't know, some kind of way. I want to play around, but I do have two of them. I mean, I can definitely wear them. I have holes beyond my first holes. I mostly only wear earrings in the first holes now, but I do still have a second and a third on this one and then two up top on this one. So I have a total of seven holes in my ears. But uh, yeah, I'm going to play around and kind of stick these little studs in. They were so cute. Now next, I also got a couple of bracelets and another little ring. I'll show you the other little ring first. Very cute little novelty kind of ring. This ring was 99 cents. It's a silver uh, poker playing card ring. And if you look at it, it has like all the little face cards on top. And it is adjustable. And again, it was 99 cents. And I just thought it would be fun. Maybe I'll wear it when I go to the casino sometime if I play poker. You know, make me look a little edgy. Or I can just wear it with black um, accessories. And still kind of cute. Also, I got this... I'll save that for last. This really, really neat um, bracelet. It's called the uh, unisex punk rock style zipper bangle. It's all one piece, but it looks like the teeth of a zipper, and it even has a little tab here. It doesn't come down, but it just is there, and it's kind of novel, and it makes a little noise, and it's really cute. I got it in the gold tone. Um, they also had it, I think, in silver, and I think like a black tone that looked more pewter to me. But I just thought it was nice and edgy to have a zipper on your wrist. I mean, how cool is that? And I may actually go back and order the other ones. These, This one was $2.50. I may get it in silver. Not sure yet. And lastly, this is really beautiful. You're going to be shocked when I tell you how cheap it was. This is called the Vintage Gorgeous Blue Peacock with Drop Gem uh, Bangle Bracelet. Look at this. Can you see that? How pretty. I mean, it has rhinestones, and I'm sure these are just like little plastic beads as opposed to mimic like a t bold turquoise stone, but how beautiful. It definitely looks vintage. Uh, and I like the fact that it has a hinge here, so it can fit, you know, different size wrists. Um, it definitely fits smaller wrists, which is what I love. And that's what it looks like on. Can you imagine wearing that with just a simple black dress and to see the pop of this bracelet up against that? I mean, that is just awesome. $2.59. How beautiful is that? Okay. So, yes, this is my little haul. Um, I'll put the link to the seller below. Like I said, I had a very good experience with them. And I would recommend, you know, if you're interested in picking up a few little novelty accessory pieces, of course, they're not going to be you know, silver and gold, but if you like little costumey type jewelry and you like to really jazz up your outfits with accessories, then I would recommend that you check them out. So I hope you found this helpful. Hope you like the pieces and I will see you soon in another video. Bye guys.